Miles, you know how many followers you've gained since the app went live? It's crazy! And I've been running some numbers, and I know you said no to ask. Before, but maybe we could reconsider. No. Right. No. Uh, of course not. Just saying. So did you find Finn's phone? Yeah. But uh, it melted after I absorbed energy from a new form reactor. What? How are you not dead? It felt like I was for a minute there. But then I released all the energy in kind of a mini explosion. Luckily, I didn't bring down the whole lab. Man, I gotta start taking notes on all your new powers. So, what's the plan now? Uncle Aaron thinks I should tell Finn I want to join the underground. Then I could take the new form so she doesn't use... Whoa, like, lie to her face? Hey, man. Hi, Miles. This challenge tests your point launch skills. Hit all the checkpoints before time runs out. Approach the prompt to begin. You got this. Well, I'm ready for this. Let's boogie. Starting to work up a sweat. chasing especially speedy pigeons. lie to Finn's face? Yeah, but I don't have any other leads. You know what we need? Don't say a pros and cons list. A pros and cons list, exactly. I gotta make a move, man. I guess. Well, good luck. Call if you need me. How you do 
Okay, yeah. Windmilling people? Very satisfying. Finn, get her to let me in the underground. Hey, Miles. You okay? Uh, yeah. Why would you say that? Oh, uh, I saw the news about your mom's rally. We're fine. Do you have time to get coffee, maybe? I can make time. Yeah. There's a place on Edison, near Fisk Tower. They don't do foam art, but people don't take pictures of their lattes, so worth it. Okay, meet you there. Okay, halfway into infiltrating a dangerous group of criminals. Cool, cool. about being the one who talks the most, or the loudest. But look, this debate is going to happen. I couldn't live with myself if I didn't try, and hey, maybe we'll all learn something. Next week, I'll post an edited version of the debate with Triple J, with the full transcript on my blog. Until then, remember to invest in blue light filters if screens give you headaches. Bye. What should I use this for? <sighs> Can't let the underground and rocks on fight here. Innocent people will get hurt. Taking aim! 
street side shootout stop. City protected. y'all, we're gonna be a little bit more serious today. If you were hurt in the Underground's attack on Roxxon Plaza, physically or emotionally, please, please get help. There's a list of resources on my blog. Switching topics, I'm pulling together an expose on the Underground, and I need your help. If you have any information you can share, it could help us shine a light on a group that needs to be taken down. Till next time, stay safe. And remember, your mental health is just as important as your physical health. Bye.
Heads up. Donation stand's getting mugged near you. Seriously? You cannot rob donation stands. Especially during the holidays. Charity. This don't concern you! Feels like half the city's got a hotline to Spider-Man these days. He's mine! Spider-Man saves the holidays. Thank you so much. I wasn't sure how I'd stop you. You ever need my help again? Ping my app. I could use Peace North is shut down. Way too cold for people to be out on the street. Genki, I'm gonna talk to Gloria about Feast, as me, not Spider-Man. Undercover by not being undercover. I like it. Thank you, man. I think that's her in the tent. 
Hey, Gloria. What's going on? Why is everyone outside? A pipe burst. We cleaned it up, but the city won't let us reopen till the plumbing's fixed. I've had it repaired three times, but it keeps breaking down. Can you send people to other fee shelters? They're at capacity. Everyone here, they've got nowhere else to go. We're trying to keep people warm and fed, but in this weather... Anything I can do to help? Yeah, actually. Could you check on the people camped in the park? They don't always open up to management. Happy to. Then get back to your vacation. You work too hard. Yeah, yeah. I need to figure out what happened with the water. Maybe someone here knows. Fine, and I've got a nice warm apartment to go back to. I'll get that. Thank you. I'm Steph, Gloria's girlfriend. I'm volunteering at Feast. Or what's left of it. Yeah. Gloria said the city won't reopen the building. They're being unusually stubborn. And they showed up so fast to condemn us, less than an hour after the flood. Uh, I sound like I should be wearing a, a tinfoil hat, huh? No, that's weird. Well, listen, thanks for your help. Okay, suspicious. I should keep talking to people. Maybe I can fix this. Blankets, or maybe food. Here, I got you. Thanks, man. I'm trying to keep this stuff dry. I was so worried we'd get robbed, and the flood happened. I even bought a knife. Why did you think that? Caught some guys casing the place. Chased them off, but they just came back. Then they up and disappeared right before the flood. Huh. Well, let me know if you need anything else. Be careful with that knife. Can do. Thanks. You didn't tell me that, about us getting cased. Hey there. Did I overhear you talking about someone from the city? Yeah. About a month ago. Shelter put in a new water heater. Inspector came by. He said we were in good shape. Then all this went down. Yeah. You'd think he'd catch that. I gotta run. Stay warm. You too. Hey, you busy? Working on speed Nonagon. What'd you find? Guys were casing feasts right before it flooded. The city swooped in like suspiciously fast to condemn the building. And an inspector said the pipes were fine right before one burst. You think sabotage? Definitely. I need to change into my suit. I 
should change. Gloria said the city will reopen the shelter if the pipes are fixed. Let's see if I can pull it off. Storm drain. Clog by trash. Uh, no wonder the pipe burst. Cleared the trash. I don't think the water's running. Oh, I know how to fix it. You gotta find the pump station. How do you know that? I did a clean up the rivers project in fourth grade. So they're sparkling clean now? Well, cleaner. Do not go in the Hudson. the guys I fought at the power station. Okay, I get the bank heist, but why mess with Feast? Let's find out. You think he'll start running protection again? Well, once he's settled in, sure. We have a good trip. What the hell was that? What was that noise? Get a lucky shot, kid! Take your best shot! Here, tell me who's paying you! You can't take all of us! My turn! You're not bad, kid! My turn! We can compromise. You leave Feast alone, and I... actually got nothing to offer. You gotta turn on the pump. Hey, clean up the rivers guy. Pump's pressure is in the red. Looks like they messed with the valves. You'll have to reset them individually before you can turn on the pump. Did you hear those guys? Their boss wants to run crime in Harlem. Drugs, protection. Uh, can't people just visit for the food and museums and not make a mess? Non-Spider-Man related question. Have you started Jane Eyre for Miss Mallard's class? I haven't done any homework since school let out. It's wild. I just finished this wedding scene and... <sighs> can't put it down. Are you reading right now? I thought you were helping me. Uh, yep, nope, I I'm here. You have my undivided attention. As soon as I finish this chapter, five minutes. Food. Behind trash. Oh. <sighs> Oh, man. 
thing that's so cold. One valve down, two to go. This one's got a pressure meter. Probably means it's old. Oh, crap, oh, crap, oh, crap. Ah, I gotta web it. Need the water pressure right in the middle, or it could rupture the pipes again. Pressure's not high enough yet. <sighs> Gotta wait for more pressure. Won't work. Water pressure's too low. <sighs> Still too low. Need a way for the pressure to build. <laughs> Won't work. Water pressure's too low. No, water pressure's too high. <sighs> That's two. One more, and I can turn the water back on. These guys are everywhere. Hey guys, wanna tell me who your boss is? No? Okay, fine. There's no concern This here's a private business venture. Just walk away. You don't want to cross the sky we institute. Got you now. This is why we don't mess with shelters. If you all left Harlem alone, I leave you alone. Maybe. Down and start to we could always run. 
Got a shot! Is this yours? I got him! Get over here! Whoa! Dodge this! Now for the pressure valve. Should be fixed. I need to turn on the water at the pump station. Hey, Genki, can you call the city? Get them to send someone to Feast North and declare it uncondemned. One official sounding call from a high school student pretending to be an adult, coming up. Turn up the goon squad. Need to get rid of these guys. They look so peaceful knocked out. Never actually been to see the boy. And if so, they don't let me see. Only way to contact them is that thing you set up for me. <sighs> Most of those guys were on his payroll before he went to prison. Just overheard. Their boss is in the rack. Oh, whoa. Right side. Maybe we can cut off however he's communicating with people on the outside. I'll look into it. Now we gotta turn on the water.
water coming on. Now. Great timing. City inspector just got the feast. Should be able to reopen soon. Cool. I'm gonna head there. Make sure Gloria's got everything she needs. So, reasons for the boss of this whole shady operation to go after Feast. One, the land it's on? Prime real estate. Two, having a shelter in Harlem reduces crime, like, a lot. And if he wants to be a crime boss, he actually needs crime to boss around. Exactly. But we stopped him. Go team! Always happy to meet one of you guys. Oh, uh, <clears throat> yeah, listen, I was fixing the water system and I noticed your shelter was affected. Should be fixed now, though. That was you? Inspector just came by, said we're good to open. Everyone can go inside. Oh, Spider-Man, you've got perfect timing. Don't know how much longer we would have held out. Thank you. Hey, Gloria. It's Miles. I heard Feast North is open again. We had a little help from Spider-Man, if you can believe it. But thanks for stopping by. People in the park said you helped a lot. Happy to. Now get back to your winter break. We'll see you when school starts back up. All right. Bye. Feast North is reopened thanks to us. Dream Team. Always. I'm gonna chase down this lead about the boss communicating from the raft. If we can cut him off, we're gold. Sounds good. I'll keep checking the app. Thanks, bro. enough during the holidays. There is now a tropical storm slash hurricane creeping its way up the coast. Oh yeah, just like that movie where the boat gets flipped over by a big wave, you know? Oh, sorry, spoilers. Anyway, if this storm hits, a lot of people are going to need help. So now's a great time to donate to your local shelter. Until next time, remember to check your credit score annually. to get one free report per year, so be... Salt in progress. Yeah. 
This will make something useful. Today I have the honor of welcoming Roxxon Energy's head of R&D, Simon Krieger. Mr. Krieger, you've been out promoting the benefits of your new form reactors, the first of which is set to open in Harlem soon. Yet, you've had some critics. Hmm. Well, first off, Jonah, uh, let me say what an honor and a pleasure it is to be on your show. Oh, well, I'm blushing. And, yeah, you're right, we've had some resistance. Most notably from Rio Morales, who uh, looks to be a new city council member in the upcoming special election. And I have a, I have a lot of respect for Ms. Morales. Uh, she's smart, she's a great role model for young women, but I think she's putting her energy in the wrong place. Our new form reactors will make this a better city, a better home for New Yorkers. But I, I, I guess some people just have a hard time with change. Let me give you some advice. One highly successful man to another. You know what I like to say to my critics? F you and the horse you're riding on! <laughs> well, okay, I, I, uh, I admire your conviction. You're, uh, you're a man who's not afraid to pay a fine in order to make uh, your point. Fine? What do you mean? Jared, how much? Do your editing thing, quick!
Good news, friends. Feast North is back on its feet. And guess who we have to thank? That's right, the new Spider-Man. Y'all, what doesn't this guy do? Okay, if you have pictures of Spidey cleaning up Feast, send them my way and I'll feature them on the blog. Till next time, remember that a 10 minute nap will give you the energy boost you need. <sighs> that we all need, actually. Okay, goodbye. Got to meet Finn for coffee. Folks, the Feast Centers have had a rough go ever since their founder, Martin Lee, turned out to be the mad bomber known as Mr. Nail. But I believe in the Feast Centers, because I knew May Parker, the brave woman who literally gave her life to keep them going. So I was distressed to hear the Harlem branch recently suffered a damaging flood. With us is Gloria, director of that center. Yeah, thanks. Uh, anyone who wants to donate to the cleanup, check out our website. It's tax deductible. Wonderful. 
I'm donating 10% of my paycheck for this week, and half of Jerry's. Now, I'm hearing Spider-Man may have been responsible for the flood. No way. Someone was responsible, but it wasn't Spider-Man. Follow the money. Who benefits from lower property values? And I'm going to stop you there, because we have a strict policy of not saying anything that will get me sued. Incidentally, I'm pretty sure Spider-Man can't afford lawyers. He wasn't Spider-Man. We're out of time. Thanks so much for joining us, Gloria. And remember, everyone, if you want to be a real hero, not like a certain masked menace, donate to Feast. Jared, cut her mic before I end up in the poorhouse. friends and welcome to the Danacast. You may have heard that I endorsed candidate Rio Morales for city council in the special election. So today I'm interviewing her, for real. Thank you for being on, Miss Morales. Thank you for inviting me. I absolutely love your show. 
Aw, thanks. So you're running against the incumbent in your district. How do you think you can do better? Unlike my opponent, I live in the district, and I listen to the people who call it home. I want Harlem to be as vibrant and safe as it was while I was growing up here. Roxanne Plaza was built on the current leadership's watch. That alone should make anyone think twice about voting for him. We agree on that. Switching gears a bit, you're a full-time science teacher. What made you want to jump into politics? It's really about loving my home and wanting to fight for it. During Martin Lee's attack on City Hall, my husband gave his life to protect others. I want to honor his memory by fighting for my neighbors and friends the best way I know how. Good luck in the polls, and thank you for being on the show. Dana fans, you can join an AMA with Candidate Morales on my blog for the next hour. Until next time, remember to set one minute per hour aside for deep, meditative breathing. Helps you clear your head. Okay, bye!